Welcome back to Necrotech Gaming. Today I am bringing you Killer 2.0 with my turret tower design. We're going to be starting out with a simple 4x4. Place the generator directly on the ground right in the middle. Fill it up with however much element you need to to keep it running for the rest of the however long you're going to need it. And then put some foundations on top of it. After that, the center four foundations are going to go 20 high with pillars. and then start vault dropping them. They're gonna start on the outside corners and go 10 high. If you've watched my other videos, you know that Pretty much all of the designs are consistent. They're designed to be kind of modular and able to be changed as needed. That way they fit pretty much wherever you're gonna need them, which is gonna be a nice thing about these. They're pretty, uh, what's the word, flexible? Able to be utilized in different situations. We're gonna place the jump pads all the way around. and set them to the big target and 100%. You're gonna wanna wait to turn these on until you vault drop the outer perimeter and then jump on the inside and then turn them on from the back side of them. After they're all on, go up top and then start placing the ceilings all the way around the top perimeter of the lower half.
Then I like to drop mine down on the bottom half two at a time until you get to the bottom two, and then I like to go one and one. On the top half, I like to go down every three because this is mostly just to deal with flyers. Then we're going to start placing our hatch frames. Now you do have the option to fill in the middle with the vaults before you place everything, but I kind of messed up the order on this. This is an unofficial design, so you can clip the vaults kind of inside of each other. After the hatch frames are placed, you can start placing your turrets. I like going with a 50-50 half heavy half tech set up and I like to alternate that way it's a little bit more difficult to shoot the tech turrets out with either a tech saddle or a tech rifle or any of that stuff this makes it a little bit harder to do they have to do one at a time they can't shoot four or five out at once In the very top I like to do all heavies that way they can't be shot out by a tech tappy gyro saddle and then I don't show it in the video but I like to usually put those all on the very very top players only that way they will shoot the riders off of a tech rex tech rock drake or the uh tappy a little bit easier
I hope you like the design and if you get value out of this video, please smash that like and subscribe button. It motivates me and lets me know that I am providing good quality content to you guys and that you're getting something from it. Thank you, and as always, happy arcing.